pair of jeans that fit just right in the radio whoa, whoa, whoa. hey guys what is going on and welcome back to what shall we do next i'm mike your host and i hope you guys are having the best day ever and today i promised you guys that i was going to start getting more into the paranormal and i thought what can i do today so i had some pretty cool ideas excuse me i'm just ooh, 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 ah, just itching um but I, th I have some pretty cool ideas planned, but I'm still doing a little research. I actually fell a little behind today, so I didn't get a chance to do what I was going to do in the first place, what I wanted to do. Um, so that being said, I last minute came up with something else, and it's something personally I've never tried in my own house, in my own attic. So that is right. Today, as you guys can tell by the title of this video, I'm about to break out the spirit box and uh, we're gonna see if my attic is haunted. Cause sometimes like creepy things go on in here, but it's nothing like too creepy. It could just be like, you know, things creaking and stuff like that. But there's sometimes noises or like, you know, I, I hear something moving way in the shadows of the, the, point, the point of the house kind of thing. And I'm like, what's that? I don't know, like it's, it's creepy. Anyway. Here with me today, I have my good friend. By the way, if you guys are new here, please subscribe if you haven't already done that. We just hit 120,000 subscribers, so thank you all so much for that. And today we're gonna be using the SPB7 Spirit Box ITC research device, as you guys can see right here. And uh, I don't care, I don't know if you guys care about all of this stuff, but it's, uh, it is a, it's an actual spirit box, as you guys can see. I'm pretty sure they use this, this model on um, ghost adventures and stuff like that. Just gonna pop up the little pokey stick and turn on this. This is a, a microphone, um, not a microphone, like an external speaker. So you plug it into this because this is it's really not that loud. This makes the world of a difference. And we're gonna stick this in the hole. And weird thing about this though is it obviously it lights up blue, right? And it's just like a little. Um, you know headphone jack but when i took the, the the black thing off it there is no way of opening it so i don't know how you get to the batteries if ever you need to change them i'm not sure what's going to happen when it comes to that um but yeah we're gonna stick this thing on and uh we're gonna see if we can contact the other side on on set the sw the sweep rate to about 250 and plug in this and turn the volume up not too loud I think that's about good all right now we need to sweep Let's see if we can find anything. Okay. Here we go. Is there anybody here with me right now? If there is a spirit here, you can communicate with me by talking into this device. Oh my god. Chills. Did that sound like to you guys, hi, what are we doing? This is creeping me out. Let's try to sweep rate a little faster. Okay. We're getting actually some frequencies up here. Is there somebody here who would like to talk to me?
I'm not sure if you're supposed to put it on AM or FM. I have it on FM right now. Maybe I should try AM. That's, that doesn't sound quite right. To be honest, this is the first time I've ever used it, and I'm not exactly sure if I'm doing it right. It just sounds like it's switching through radio stations and... Apparently that's all it is, so I don't know, like, if there's anything else I'm supposed to do. I followed some instructions of another guy who had the same one, so. Is there anybody here who wants to talk to me? Come over to me and talk into this device. Can you say your name? If there is someone in this attic with me, can you say your name? Is there anybody here right now? I hope you guys can hear me. I forget this is so loud. Is there anybody here in this attic with me right now? Yes or no? weird how it sounded like before like when I first started it sounded like it was really active like there was a lot of voices jumping in now there's nothing I wonder if that was like a, a sign that there could be like multiple people are you still here I would like to talk to you Maybe we should stick this up again. That might be the problem. Can you tell me your name? Franklin. Franklin? Did you guys hear that? That was so, like, clear. I heard Franklin. Is your name Franklin? Is your name Franklin? Is that your name, Franklin? Can you repeat? Can you repeat that? Is that your name, Franklin? Is that you, Franklin? Yes or no? Is there anybody else here? Am 
If there's, if there's somebody here, if there's someone here, can you talk to me through this device? Come over here and talk. Do you speak English? Hello. Did you hear hello or hell no? <laughs> do, you, do you not speak English? Did you say hello? Can you say hello? If you're here, say hello. My name is Mike, and I would like to talk to you. What is your name? Mike. Did you guys hear that sound like Mike? Like he just repeated me? Did you say my name? Did you say... That is my name, Mike. What is your name? Can you tell me your name? Is your name Franklin? Am I wrong about Franklin? You don't have to be shy. Come and talk to me. Can you tell me your name, please? Are you still here? If you are here, can you say yes? If you are here, can you say yes? Is there anybody here? Come over and talk in this device. Sup. That sounded like sup. Is somebody here? Don't be shy, I won't hurt you. I just want to get to talk to you. I saw something moving. Was that you moving that thing over there? Alright, I'm gonna go now, but it was... It was nice talking to you, if you can hear me. Well... I don't have much time on my camera, so I'm going to cut it here, but I'll try again another time. I did get some kind of little responses, but I, I don't know. I mean, nothing that says my addict is haunted right now, but I am a little scared to go down in the dark. Like, I got to turn out all these lights now, walk to the other end of the attic where the stairs are, and I got to get out. It's going to be scary, especially when you're, like, climbing down and your head's the last thing to go through the hole and it's dark in here. But thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow with hopefully the start of a new series. If not, I'll come up with something else, but it'll be good. Um, 
I mean, I guess we could try that again another time. It's, some things did kind of, sound, kind of sound responsive, but it could have just been anything. You know, it is flicking through radios, so it might have just been coincidence. You just got to keep that in mind. Like, the only way I think you can determine that it's real is if it's like answering you, you know. Um, if it's very responsive and it makes sense every time kind of thing. I think that's the only way you can determine whether it's real or not. Otherwise, it could have just been nothing. So thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. Hit that like button down below. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Remember, the most important thing of all, chase your dreams. I love you all. Thank you.